Welcome to the Pilates Show, where we explore Pilates tips and techniques to help deepen the skill level of the movement educator while having fun. Hi, Jen and Amelia here, and again, we're using the foot bar and the stability ball to help find one of Amelia's favorite positions, which is this big supported forward hang position. Now to get into it, we're gonna use kind of the push and pull on the bar as she slowly goes into an arch and then slowly into flexion. So she's opening the front of her spine and then she can push the bar and the ball away from each other, find that little hang forward into flexion. And then she can pull herself forward using her hands, heels back to open the front of the spine, open the chest and then push and curl back. Good, and keep going. The ball is such a nice surface to, that the, the sacrum and the ilium can still move into it. It's not being blocked. So she can find this really fluid arch and curl and the sacrum actually being able to nutate and counter nutate. And this pulsation of her pelvic floor opening and closing between the pulsating bones. And then when she's ready, she can stay in that hang and she can stay in the hang and do like a little push pull with the hands, maybe moving side to side a little bit, kind of just an intuitive movement, whatever feels good. But this is a really nice position because it takes the baby in the uterus off the spine. It's opening through for a lot of women, very tight tissue in their lumbar spine. So this usually feels really good at the sacral plateau, opening up through the sacrum. She's letting the head and neck go. And then when she's ready, she can slowly pull herself forward. And it's really nice for the mother to have this grounding force with her hands and her arms, which is why I love using the ball and the foot bar because we're kind of prepping in a way um, for her labor delivery birth. A lot of times when we're pushing and we're allowed to get into positions that um, that help us to use our body to help the baby get out of the birth canal, we're gonna be using our arms and hands. And that force is gonna be able to help the pelvis open in ways that are, that's gonna to help to guide the baby out. So this is a, a brilliant way to allow the mother to really use the grounding forces, forces of their arms and their hands to communicate with their pelvis. That's it for today. If you have a different take on today's subject or if there's anything you'd like to see covered in an upcoming episode, we'd love to hear from you. Comment below, on Facebook, Twitter, or in the forum at fusionpilatesedu.com. See you next time and never stop learning.